Hi. Well, seems like uh, the Muslims are getting friskier. In other words, more and more uh, terror in the cause of Allah. You know? Seems like there's a Muslim, a Muslim doing some horrible thing to some non-Muslim all the time. And mostly in Germany. And Germany is the one that's been bending over backwards to let them come in and, and, and you know, giving them, you know, welfare and everything like that. And how they repay them? By taking a machete and, and chopping up some poor woman, you know. And it just seems to be getting worse and worse. And I think the reason why it's getting worse and worse is because Muslims are becoming aware of what Allah wants from them. They're coming upon they're coming upon the Quran 9, 111, 38, and 39 that threaten them with a painful doom if they don't go forth killing being killed in the cause of Allah. They come upon that those scriptures instead of say Quran 36, 40 through 43, which infers that the sun and moon travel in boats similar to that of Noah, you know, Noah's Ark. Of course, in Al Tabar Hadith, it's not the Ark that the sun and moon travel in, but according to Muhammad, it's 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 a ch it's a chariot. That the sun moon travel in, and if the sun falls out of its chariot, uh, out of that chariot, uh, uh, a solar eclipse occurs. I mean, the Muslims are coming are coming upon Quran nine hundred eleven thirty eight thirty nine rather than which tells them to kill and be killed in the cause of law, or feel or experience a painful doom, rather than say. Well, you know how uh, like Quran thirty Quran ninety six, which uh, is called the clot. Of course, the Muslims will say, no, 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 that means a clinging leech like substance. Actually, it's a clot because in, in Sahih, that's sound hadith, Muhammad says, can, re, inferring, re, referring to uh, embryos, uh, actually inferring about embryos, that uh, it, the embryo, becomes a clot of blood for 40 days. Not that it looks like, but it becomes a clot of blood for 40 days. Muslims don't realize that. Instead, they just think about Quran 911, 13, 39, that threaten them with a painful doom. And I want to tell you something. Under Sharia law, if you, a non-Muslim, are not paying jizya tax, you can be killed by the Muslim, and there's no repercussions. Doesn't have to pay. Doesn't have to face time. You're like a cow under Sharia law. Under Sharia law, your rights are as about as that of a cow. You can be slaughtered. You know, and uh, but if you are paying jizya tax and you have protection, you know, because you know, Muslims would rather have you paying jizya tax than being a Muslim, because un under Sharia law, the jizya tax can be as much as eighty-five percent of your earnings, like it is with the Christians under ISIS. Uh, the Christians will be killed if they don't pay eighty-five percent of their earnings in jizya tax. So the Muslims would rather have you not convert so you can pay jizya tax, which can be, again, 85% of your earnings, like it is under ISIS for the Christian. But anyway, I was thinking that the best way to end Islamic terror, if you're not going to hit Mecca with uh, cruise missiles carrying pig poo, or, and then nuking Mecca during the Hajj, if that, doesn't, if that just makes things worse, is that... We'd, we'd have a reverse Sharia here where non-Muslims can only own guns. If a, non, if a Muslim is found to be owning a gun, oh, bad, bad. He, he, he'll, it's capital punishment right on the spot if he's found to have a gun on him. And if he shoots a Muslim, if, 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 a, non, if, if a Muslim shoots a Muslim, instead of bulldozing his house like Netanyahu would do, his whole family gets rubbed out, rubbed out, so he can't shoot non-Muslims. Whereas a Muslim, or as a non-Muslim, can shoot a Muslim and there'd be no problem. Doesn't have any time or anything like that. It, in other words, a total reverse Sharia law here going on. And I think that would end Islam really fast. But you want to know something? According to Quran 98.6, non-Muslims are the worst of creatures. I mean, they're worse than snakes, they're worse than pigs, they're worse than dogs, according you know, the worst the worst of creatures are a non Muslim. And the Muslims would be expecting non Muslims to go into houses and just rub out the Muslim family and everything. But I don't think that would happen. And the Muslims would be expecting like, oh my gosh, if Muslims are so evil non Muslims are supposed to, are so evil they'll do this. And when it doesn't happen, to me that will hurt Islam more than anything.
when they see that non-Muslims aren't evil and they aren't going out killing uh, Muslims right and left for the fun of it when they see that, that that's not happening then Islam will crumble and no more of this uh, what's going on in Germany and everything and killing non-Muslims right and left even though Merkel bend over backwards to let them in and give them welfare and stuff.